Hey, welcome back to Oblivion. I am here in Cloud Ruler Temple, picking up right where I left off last time. It has been mere minutes since I stopped recording the previous video, and I'm now going to continue with the next one. I'm still recording on Friday night, December 29th, 2017. So, we find ourselves here after bringing Martin here. Martin is going to hole up here in safety, surrounded by the blades, the Emperor's protectors. Last time I myself became a blade, although I... It doesn't seem to really suit my character to be a blade, but... Um, I got a free sword out of it, so... Can't really complain too much about it. So let's see, what... What is our plan for this video? Joffrey wants me to contact Barris at Luther Broad's boarding house in the Imperial City. The enemy has the Amulet of Kings, and Barris may have the leads we need to get it back. That's right, last time we found that, uh, we rescued Martin, but we lost the Amulet of Kings. He had to take it from me, and he lost it. It's all his fault. So, I am just going to take the easy road and fast travel down to the Imperial City Elven Gardens District to see if I can find Barris. I hope they don't mind having horses there. You know, actually, I'm not even going to take the horse. I'm going to leave my horse right here. Stay, horse. Stay. Ma'am. Good horsey. Okay. Imperial City Elven's Garden District. Here we come. I expect there's going to be a lot of people talking when I get there. Have pity, beautiful lady. I got nothing to eat. Ralav the Faker? Was that you talking to me? I'm only asking for enough to feed me kids. Hey, I don't have any money either. I just started this game. Tell me some rumors, though. There's been some terrible trouble at the chapel in Anvil. All of Dubella's priests and priestesses murdered. I've heard that one already. I wouldn't give you a coin for that even if I had some. Maybe I can persuade you. We'll see. Uh, wow, I did that well and it only moved from 50 to 52. Oh well. Alright, the cat is prowling around and the dog is eating a stick, but I'm going to try How are you? to play some more. Hi there. You have my ear, citizen. Is there a problem? No problem, just, uh, may I have directions? What are you looking for? Where are the guilds? There are no guild halls in the city, but the Arcane University is on an island outside the walls, south of the Arboretum. Mm, tell me about your major landmarks. The Imperial Palace is at the center. The six districts are arranged around the palace like spokes of a wheel. Starting in the northeast, moving clockwise, you have the market, arena, arboretum, Temple, Talos Plaza, and Elven Gardens districts. The waterfront is south of Temple District. The Arcane University is south of the Arboretum. The Imperial Prison is north of Market District. Obviously, I will never remember that in a million years. I'm very glad that there's a map that I can just pull up and look at. Where are the services? You'll find smiths, alchemists, booksellers, maid shops, clothiers, armorers, and general traders in the market district. That makes perfect sense. Where can I sleep? Merchants Inn in the market, King and Queen in Elven Gardens, the Tiber Septum in Talos Plaza, and all saints in Temple District. There's also the bloated float on the waterfront, but... <laughs> That's not a very nice neighborhood. 
Okay, thank you. Yes? Hmm, well, I tried. That's not bad. Move along. I'm just gonna try to persuade everybody I meet. Irene Metric. I'm Irene Metric. If you needed to know more, you'd already know. Tell me about Imperial City. I don't trust you enough to talk about that. But we're standing right here in the Imperial City. Surely you can tell me. At least tell me a rumor. The Grey Fox sounds like a dangerous thief. What a great story. You can't scare me. Seventy. Let's try that. Now can you tell me about the Imperial City? To know the right things, you have to know the right people. Ida Vlinorman, Mandil, Samuel Bantian, and Athralus are the right people. Ah, thank you. I did it. I persuaded someone. Bye. I already don't remember any of those names. I'm really bad with names. So, let's just look for the red marker. It's going to be very easy to get distracted around here. Luther's... Luther Broad's boarding house. It's right here. Let's talk to Jastia Sintav while she's standing Jastia here. Jastia Sintav. Jenna's my sister. Uh, who is Jenna? Have you heard of the Grey Fox? <gasps> He's that wanted criminal. Isn't he a master thief? I hear he's dangerous, too. I've heard that the beggars spy for him. Oh, okay. Uh, tell me about the Imperial City. I'm sick of all this fighting with the Aetius clan. I'm glad Uncle Inil put his foot down. You know, you actually sound just like the other woman I was just talking to. Have you heard any rumors? The Fighters Guild is recruiting again. Not a bad way to make some money, if you've got the stones for it. Well, I'm more of a thief than a fighter, but... Oh, well. Thank you. Good day. Well met. Have you ever met anyone who barters better than Palinaria? She's the best in the city, and she'll teach others. It'll cost you, though. Good night. Goodbye. Tidings, citizen. <laughs> it's so funny how it sounds like they're talking to themselves. Let us enter the wooden door to Luther Broad's boarding house. Barris, he's sitting right there. Let's talk to Luther Broad first. Luther Broad's boarding house. I'm Luther. You want beds or food? See me. Um, can you repair anything? A little food and drink will do you some good. How about if I sell you some of my ale? My personal stock of ale. Tell your friends about me. Have you heard of the Grey Fox? Blasted thief. I hope they string him up when they catch him. Oh, he's a slippery one, though. The beggars are his eyes and ears. I heard that. Tell me about Imperial City. I don't trust you enough to talk about that. Oh, fine, then. Have you heard any rumors? The Fighters Guild is recruiting again. Not a bad way to make some money, if you've got the stones for it. All right, then. I guess I'll try to persuade you. All right. Is that so? Disposition maxed. All right, let me give him 14 gold for a six bonus. What a thoughtful gift. There we go. 64. That's not bad. Now can you tell me about the Imperial City? Daedric Shrine's nearby. I know of two. North of the city, south of Bruma, east of the Silver Road is a Mephala Shrine. East of the city, at the head of the Red River, is a shrine to Vermina. Okay. Thank you for the map markers. I don't know what that has to do with the Imperial City, but it's fine. Farewell. Who is this sitting over here? Astav Weirich. Move along, friend. Hmm. Well, that's suspicious. Any 
anything up here? All right, Barris. What are you doing here? Sit down. Don't say anything. Just do what I say. Yes. Listen, I'm going to get up in a minute and walk out of here. That guy in the corner behind me will follow me. You follow him. Good. Remember, wait for him to follow me. I want to see what he'll do. Oh, come on. How do I don't know how to get out of this chair. Somebody help! Come quickly! <laughs> oh, no! We've got a burglar! No! I'm not trying to steal. I'm just trying to get out of this chair. How do I get up? You're kidding me. I don't know how to get out of this chair. Forward. Today? Forward, back, front, left. Sneak. Jump. A. Left click. Stop right there, criminal scum! Nobody breaks the law on my watch! I'm confiscating your stolen goods. Now pay your fine, or it's off to jail. Fine. This has all been a terrible mistake. Here's your bounty. That's too bad. I was hoping you'd resist arrest. I'm a okay. fine. Here's the procedure. We go to the castle. First, we search you, confiscate any stolen goods. Then you pay your fine, and we release you. No! I'm supposed to be following. The, the guy is like... Ah. Uh, you have my ear, citizen. Where do I go? Hail, good citizen. Okay. How can I be of service? Did I pay my fine? Am I done? I don't know where I am now. <laughs> how do, I still don't know how to get out of the chair. How did I get out of the chair? I think maybe I left clicked. I'm just following the markers now. Don't worry, Barris. I'm coming. I will be there shortly. Barris has probably been, like, stabbed in the back or something, because I wasn't there. I wasn't there for him. Whoops, that's the North Watchtower. I'm sorry, Barris. I'm sorry. It wasn't my fault. What is it, citizen? I'm here to relieve. Any time now. There's the boarding house. Let me go inside. I didn't mean to steal your stuff. There he is. Sneak attack. The enemy agent who attacked Barris is dead. I should find out what Barris has learned about our enemies. Ooh, he's got Mythic Dawn commentaries. What is that? I have found a strange book about the Mythic Dawn cult. I should show this to Barris. And steal his gold. That's for accidentally getting me to steal stuff. Good work. I am glad to see you, by the way. You just caught me at a bad time. What have you learned? The assassins who killed the Emperor were part of a Deirdre cult known as the Mythic Dawn. Apparently worshipped the Deirdre Lord Mayrunes Dagon. I've been tracking their agents in the Imperial City. I guess they noticed. 
The enemy has the amulet, by the way. So everything's been for nothing. What? They took it from Joffrey? Things are worse than I had thought. Well, it's not all bad. I found Uriel's heir. Thank Talos he lives! Martin Septim, you say? We will restore him to the throne. It is the sworn duty of all blades! Not so loud. You don't want everyone in the city to hear you, do you? What's our next move? There's a scholar at the Arcane University. Tarmina's her name. Supposed to be an expert on Diedrich cults. Why don't you take that book to her? See what she makes of it. I'll keep running down leads on the Mythic Dawn network. If you learn anything, you can find me at Luther Broads. May Talos guide you. Tell me more of Tarmina. Like I said, she's one of the brains over at the Arcane University. Supposed to know everything there is to know about Diedrich cults. Well, that's not very much. I hope you learned something from Tarmina about that book. This might just be the break we need. It just might be the break we need. I'm gonna steal from this chest. Oops, maybe. <laughs> oh man, there's not a thing in there worth taking. What a waste. Ooh, a chest that's very hard. Oh, I'll skip that one for now. Okay, nothing here worth taking, I guess. What do you need, friend? Nothing. Tell the bartender that I didn't mean to steal his stuff. Okay, so we need to go to the Arcane University, which is way over there. I could just fast travel. That would be the easiest thing to do. Whoa, purple flames. Your horse is stabled outside the city gates. That's handy. How goes it? What is it, citizen? An Imperial Legion battle mage. What are you doing here? Well met, citizen. I see few new faces these days, it seems. With the Emperor's murder, a darkness has fallen upon all of Cyrodiil. That's rather a grim assessment of the situation, don't you think? Have you heard of the Grey Fox? He's just a thief. He's supposed to be the head of the Thieves' Guild. Oh, what a joke. Can you imagine a bunch of thieves trying to form a guild? The nobility hate him, but the peasants and the beggars love him, especially in the waterfront. Hmm, the waterfront, you say? Maybe I'll pay a visit to that waterfront sometime. Come find me. This gray fox sounds like a delightful fellow. Let's go into the Archmage's lobby. Hello, Master Wizard. Looking for an axe or a mace? Head do slash and smash. The name says it all. Lots of big weapons there. Herbal always has some in stock. Farewell. Good evening. Slash and bash? Is that what you said? Let's talk to Bothiel first. What do you want? I'm just here asking about the Imperial City, that's all. The orrery here is the only one in Cyrodiil. There's one more in Hammerfell, the old one at Stros Mackay. Have you heard any rumors? Necromancy may be legal in Cyrodiil. But few will openly admit to practicing it now that the Mage's Guild has banned it. Something I can do for you? It is fashionable to make fun of Breville and Regulus Terentius. Personally, I think it is poor sport to mock the poor and disadvantaged. All right. Three what brothers have some good merchandise. Don't know if I've met all three brothers, though. I don't know which is which. Still, it's a good shop they run. <clears throat> Heard any news from the other provinces? 
Nothing I'd like to talk about. Take care. Good to see you. <laughs> Tarmina, I heard that I'm supposed to talk to you for some reason. I've already forgotten why. Ah, you must be the one I got the message about. How can I help you? How did you get a message already? I just walked over here. Um, have you heard any rumors? Necromancy may be legal in Cyrodiil, but few will openly admit to practicing it now that the Mages Guild has banned it. Okay, I knew that already. Have you heard anything about the Imperial City? Too big for me. Loud, dirty. Clowns, fools, brutes, and thieves everywhere. I want to throw my gold away. I just dump it in Lake Romara, save time. That's a very strange attitude you have there. All right, let's talk about the Mythic Dawn, then. You know of them? One of the most secretive of all the Daedric cults. Not much is known about them. They follow the teachings of Maincar Cameron, whom they call the Master, a shadowy figure in his own right. I found one of their books. Ah, yes. Commentaries on the Mysterium Xarxes. Wonderful. You have a scholarly interest in Daedric cults, then. Well, I just found the book, really. I just need to find the Mythic Dawn. Find them, eh? I won't poke my nose any further. Official business and all that. I'm used to working with the Blades. Don't worry. Say no more. In any case, finding them won't be easy. I've studied Maincar Cameron's writings a bit myself. At least those that I could find. It is clear from the text that Maincar Cameron's commentaries come in four volumes, but I've only ever seen the first two books. I believe that his writings contain hidden clues to the location of the Mythic Dawn's secret shrine to Merun's Dagon. Those who unlock this hidden path have proven themselves worthy to join the ranks of the Mythic Dawn cult. Finding the shrine is the first test. If you want to find them, you'll need all four volumes of the commentaries. So I need four books and then I can find the shrine. Where can I find these books? Here. You can have the library's copy of volume two. Treat it gently, if you please. As I've said, I've never even seen the third and fourth volumes. You should try first edition over in the market district. Fintius, the proprietor, caters to specialist collectors. He may have an idea of where to locate those books. Well, all right then. What can you tell me about Mankar Cameron? The supposed leader of the Mythic Dawn cult. He wrote the infamous Commentaries on the Mysterium Xarxes. The commentaries are contemporary with Tiber's Septum over 400 years ago, so he is unlikely to still be alive, although you never know. Tell me more of the Mysterium Xarxes. The holy book of the mythic dawn, supposedly written by Merun's Dagon himself. If it exists, it would be an artifact of great and evil power. So I guess that means this Dagon guy is 400 years old. I was good at math. What else can you tell me about the Mythic Dawn? They worship the Daedra Lord Merun's Dagon, according to the teachings of their leader, Maincar Cameron. No one knows how widespread the cult is or where their shrine to Merun's Dagon is located. Well, I'm going to find out because I'm going to get all four of those books and decipher them. So nice chatting with you. Be sure to let me know how your hunt for the Mythic Dawn turns out. Well, I am over encumbered now. Thanks to your books. Thanks to your book smarts, I am now over encumbered. I guess I'm going to drop a shovel and a skull. I don't need a shovel or a skull. Or a bone. Or another bone. Or a third bone. No, I'll keep the third bone. 
No, I'm gonna drop it. I'm not gonna do alchemy, why would I even... I mean, I assume those are alchemical ingredients. Maybe not. No, they're not. I don't know what they are. Why are they even in my inventory? Uh, where are these books? Ah, here we go. The Mythic Dawn Commentaries, Volume 1. Ooh, your conjuration skill has increased. Commentaries on the Mysterium Xarxes, Book 1 by Menkar Cameron. Greetings, novish, novitiate. And no, first a reassurance. Mankar Cameron was once like you, asleep, unwise, protonymic. In this moment, we destroy her forever and enter the Demesne. Dem, demes, demesne. I don't even know how to pronounce that word. Demesne? Demens? The correct pronunciation is Demain. Demesne. Whatever. Whatever. It doesn't matter. <laughs> I'm not reading all of this book. It goes on for 12 pages. I will not be reading that. How about the Mythic Dawn Commentaries 2? Your destruction skill increased. Whosoever findeth this document, I call him brother. Answers are liberations, where the slaves of Malbioge that came to know Numantia cast down their jailer king, Mazdiak, which the Xarxes Mysterium calls the Arcane. That's enough of that nonsense. Six more pages of that. So I believe deciphering this somehow will allow us to figure out where the bad guys are. But I need two more books. Hey, there's all some stuff that I dropped on your floor. Let's check the quest log. Tarmina gave me the second of Mankar Cameron's books about the Mysterium Xarxes, but said that she has never seen Mankar Cameron's third and fourth books on the Mysterium Xarxes. She suggested that I speak to Fintius, the proprietor of the first edition bookstore in the Market District. What is it? That is a fantastic idea. However, I will save that for next time because I think I am probably getting to the end of a video here. So I will stop here and next time we will continue with a visit to the first edition. Thanks for watching. See you later.